Hello fellow modelers. This is Ron's Trains and More back with another video. I thought I'd show you guys my finished uh, coal train here, my N scale coal train. I think in my previous videos I showed you guys how to make the uh, and what to buy the coal loads. Um, I did all these last night, 12 of them. The last uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. The last eight Atlas hoppers. I just left those coal loads alone because I think the Atlas hoppers look pretty good. But yep, all twelve of those Fox Valleys right there. I put coal loads in. Well, I mean they already had coal loads. I just glued coal over the plastic loads from the factory. I mean it makes them look so much better. I mean they just look so realistic with that coal on. Uh, like I said, that bag of coal, man, it's a dollar from the Dollar Tree. It's great stuff. I'd highly recommend it. You guys try it out. Yep, that's some great. That's it's, it's a great, a great product for model railroads. It really is, just about any scale too. But um, man, it took me forever to do these coal loads though. As you can see, they look pretty darn good. Those things look pretty awesome. They turned out well. And they got that sheen, that kind of sparkle to them like real coal does when the sunlight hits it. That's what I like about that stuff too. It being sand, I think that's what makes it do that. But um, it's great stuff. I'd recommend it if you want to make you some uh, realistic, nice looking coal loads. But uh, man turned out great anyways I'll be quiet here a minute just kind of let this train run here for just a minute yeah y'all stay tuned to my uh, channel though I'm going to be doing a whole series on this 30 by 80 door layout build here I'm going to be building the whole thing and uh here soon I'm gonna have it up off the floor I'll be glad of that uh, I think I'm just gonna find me an old entertainment stand you know or something like that it's really tall because I had one in the past and to be honest I kind of like those a little bit better because I won't be moving my layout it'll stay in one spot so I don't really need no folding table but I'll get me an old entertainment stand something like that plus it's cool because it's got storage too you know, you got plenty of room under your layout to store things and stuff like that. Maybe you can get some kind of nice looking oak cherry one, you know, or something, or a black one. And uh, they look really good. I had a door door sitting on an entertainment stand before on my last gen scale layout, and I mean, it looked great. I had plenty of storage, and it was tall. The trains were just about eye level. I think they look good about eye level. But, uh, yeah, I'll get this thing up off the floor here soon and get some more track and I'm going to actually start building it. I'm going to cut a river in it and it's going to be a big mountain tunnel over there and a big yard here somewhere. The coal mine and everything. I've got that diamond coal there and Medusa cement and this water strip freight tunnel. As soon as I get those built, those will look pretty cool on here. But uh, yeah, you guys follow along and Stay tuned to my channel. I'll have all those videos coming here soon. So, uh, anyways, I just thought I'd make a quick video here and show my new coal loads that I made. But, uh, I'd highly recommend that stuff. It's great stuff. The Dollar Tree sells it for a dollar. And you can get that bottle of Lean's uh, Tacky Glue for a dollar. I think that's some of the best glue to make your coal loads with, also. This stuff right here, Turbo Tacky Glue. That stuff's great. But, uh, anyways, this is Ron Strange and more. I appreciate everyone's comments and all my subscribers and everything I've gotten recently. And uh, everyone stay safe and uh, just uh, everyone run your trains during this epidemic. Have fun running your trains. Greatest hobby in the world. But, uh, anyways, this is Ron's Trains and More. Remember, comment and subscribe.
Thanks a lot for watching my channel. And commenting. Uh, this is Ron's Trains and More. Out.